The programming of the brewer is divided into two levels. Brewing adjustments are in level one. Service functions are accessed in level two. Each screen will have instructions on how to access and the procedures to program the various functions of the brewer. Programming lockout switch, mounted on main control board. This switch can be set to prevent access to the programming settings of the brewer. Once all the correct brew settings are programmed, the operator can set the switch to the on position to prohibit anyone from changing the settings. Press hidden switch until display reads brew lockout. Brew lockout prevents brewing if the water temperature is less than the set ready temperature. Brew ounce, large. Adjust brew volume for large button. Brew meter, large. Simplified pulse brew adjustment. Brew ounce, small. Adjust brew volume for small button. Brew meter, small, one through five. Simplified pulse brew adjustment. Set temp. Adjust tank temperature from 185 to 205 degrees Fahrenheit or 85 degrees to 96 degrees Celsius. Set ready. Sets the minimum temperature allowable to start a brew cycle. Range, 2 degrees to 20 degrees Fahrenheit or 2 degrees to 10 degrees Celsius below the set temperature. Hot H2O lockout. Setting to yes will only allow dispensing of hot water at or above the H2O ready temp screen. Hot H2O ready sets the minimum temperature allowable to start dispensing hot water. Set pulse brew, large, individually adjust on off times. Air time, large, time the pod is purged at the end of each brew cycle. Set pulse brew, small, individually adjust on off times. Air time, small, 1 through 25. Time the pod is purged at the end of each brew cycle. Can be disabled if brewer is set up to dispose pods under the counter. Brews to empty, off, 15 to 25. Set number of used pods in bin to turn on empty bin message. Enable energy saver. Choose to have the tank heaters turn off or reduce the tank temp to 140 degrees Fahrenheit or 60 degrees Celsius once the set idle time has expired. Brew counts. Retains the total number of brew cycles completed. Calibrate flow. Measure and enter the actual flow rate coming out of the spray head. Flow counts per 10 ounces. Number of pulses per ounce calculated during flow calibration. For reference only, do not manually adjust. Number of ejects. You can set this to double if you experience certain types of pods that do not reliably eject on single. Brews on this seal. Use this counter to check, reset the seal replacement message. Calibrate hot water. Measure and enter the actual flow rate. Service tools. Allows testing of load components and switches. It should only be used by trained technicians. How to calibrate the flow. Press and release the bun logo until you get to calibrate flow screen. Press yes to proceed. The drawer must be in brew position. Press yes to place in the brew position. Place a container that will hold 10 ounces under the dispense nozzle. Press large button to begin. Please wait as water will flow into the cup. Empty the container and replace on drip tray. Press large button to begin. The display will show enter ounce and 10.0. Weigh the amount dispensed. Use the minus or plus buttons to adjust the value to match the amount dispensed. Press done to enter the value. 